All right, hi guys, and uh, well, we're going to be doing a stream as we do every so often, as you guys know. Um, we're actually going to be doing some stuff on a little bit of a castle that I've been building, kind of like down the river of uh, of Hamburg, down the river of Hamburg. Not really, it's not really a Hamburg river, but um, I'll show you guys on the map. It's literally over here, so I've actually started building it already. Uh, I did some building last night. I just decided to plonk some blocks down, and an hour and a half later, I had built like out of a basic castle. So. Pretty cool. How's it going, Harry Lever? Um, and it's quite an early stream actually today, isn't it? It's because I started work really early to take down a system. Oh, fun. Gens on Gaming, good to see you again, man. Yeah. It's got gra Grated Channel? Grated Channel 36 games? Gratted? I don't know. Titan of Gold as well, good to see you, Cow Carl Powell, Princess Marenth as well. How's it going? Geo as well, how's it going, Geo? So yeah, um, I have been doing a little bit of the time lapse type of stuff for the next episode of Hamburg. A lot. Uh, I have been messing around with trees as well. Um, the st these trees, right, the, the story behind these trees, anyway, randomly, um, is that uh, it's supposed to be like a, a golden elven forest. And they don't look like very big trees. I know they're supposed to be cut down a little bit. So I'm probably going to do like a, a natural forest of what's left over, and it's going to be like this style of tree. Like these kind of like really gold birch type things, so it's like more mystical and stuff. Um, but they're still cutting it down. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, so I kind of put like that in here. Who else, who else have we got? we got Thomas Griffiths. Good to see you, man. It's been a while. Barto Craft. Um, Guns on Games says, uh, it's been a long time. How have I been? I've been good, actually. I'm really knackered at the minute because I went into work really early. I had to wake up at 5 a.m. Which I don't usually. It's usually 6. So it's only an hour, but, you know, didn't sleep great. Um, who else we got? Uh, thanks, Gio. Thanks, Gio. Gio says, nice trees. Thank you very much. Anto, a.k.a. Me Mezuko-sama. New here. Uh, how did you get the... How did I get the beautiful map? I made it. I actually made it on stream. Uh, Genzung was there for pretty much all of those streams. Um, there's literally 40 hours worth. They're all they're all uploaded. But you can download it. There's a link in the description. The only thing you have to do is, if you've, if you've used... Well, you have to use Conquest Reforged. Uh, you do have to run it through the converter from uh, one point. 10 to 1.12, I think it is. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. That's what we have to do. Uh, so, who else we got as well? We got Roman Sakuna. Shout out, please. Um, well, that, that's pretty much it. I don't really do shout outs as such. It's just that I'll just answer comments and I'll, I'll say your name. So, technically, that's a shout out. It's just that it's not like a shout out. <laughs> if you know what I mean. It's just normal conversation. Um, so we also got Bram. How's it going, Bram? A forest. Well, yeah, kind of. It's it's more like trees outside of it, but we'll. I want to get rid of all these like crappier trees. I don't think it fits the land. I don't think it fits the law. Admittedly, I hadn't written the law when I was making the map, so these trees will be gone uh, and replaced with. Or be replaced with the ones that are over this way. Gobu, how's it going? Greetings from Poland. How's it going, my Polish, my Polish friend? How's it going? Um, who else we got? We got. Uh, Romana Sakuna says, uh, what texture and shader? So it's the Conquest Reforged mod, just the Conquest Reforged texture pack. And um, it's also the shader pack is uh, Trilliton's shaders, which he's very kindly actually put up on my, my edit of it. Because I, I ended up, I basically ended up, I, I can't not tweak with things. So there was a couple of things I was like, ah, I want to tweak that. I want to I get that to look how I want it to look. So I ended up tweaking it, and he's very kindly put the link up on his website. So there's actually the LD edit, so you can get the exact same version of me. Pretty good. Yeah. And uh, we've also got Eogen Waters. I cannot say your name, and I still can't do it, and you told me how to say it at one point. Damn it. <laughs> we've also got Theo Renner as well. Tom and Billet, oh, good to see you. Uh, who else we got? The link is still good for World Painter Starter. Cool. I'm glad, Genzong. I'm very glad. Um, Titan of Gold, did you finish the cemetery? What cemetery? Like, I mean, technically, I know we're supposed to be doing a castle, right? We are supposed to be doing a castle. Um, I mean, technically, we've got the small cemetery. We do need to do a big one outside. We haven't got one. I'm not going to do it on this side of the city. I'm going to do it on the other side. So I'm going to do it around here. But, um, yeah, we will get onto that. But, I mean, we've technically we've already done a little bit of it. Oh, I, I ended up, um... Uh, taking some downtime, watching some TV, and I ended up detailing the outside with vertical slabs. It took about two hours. Um, 
So I've only done this side of it, but man, that was one of those things that basically I, I was doing the. I, I finished up these trees, I think, or no, it wasn't these trees. I finished up some areas around here or something, and I ended up looking at it and just going, "It's really annoying me in the background." So I ended up doing that. Yeah. How's it going, Razor Dawn? Good to see you. Right, Kenzo Gaming, if you want, I can send you that over again via Twitter. I do on it off inevitably. Um, how do I do this world? Yeah, you could do. I think it's the link that I have on the download wrong now, Genzong. Do you know? If it is wrong, I'll, I'll update it because I can just update the link and then whenever anyone goes there, they've got it. But yeah. Um. Right. Yeah. Sorry. Cemetery. Right. Yeah. I mean, we've got the little one. We've got this little one here. This is the this is the like Christian type religion with their church. Um. So we have got that one in here. So I've got that. Anyway. Theoretic greetings from Germany. V Gates man, was ist los? That's pretty much it. I've forgotten all of my German. Yeah. Too high for just the wool. Which one? Where? Where? Where is it on? Too high for just the wool? What do you mean, Razor Dawn? What do you mean, man? Prince Panther. Uh, is this still on Yarrow? Oh, yeah, definitely, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, some of the walls are actually really small. I, I, I noticed this the other Well, I didn't really notice it the other day. It really annoyed me the other day, actually. Because I still reckon you can, like, scale it quite easily. <laughs> so, I mean, look at it. It's, like, it's pretty puny. But I did think about this, and I was like, well, actually, they don't really care, like, for the outside. They, it's just kind of, like, it's to make them feel safe. Like, obviously, this wall here is, a. Uh, it's just, it's kind of been he to help hold back the mud and the hill and... Uh, probably at some point was a defense, but what I'm thinking is when I get onto the castle of this bit, I'm going to raise all this up. I'm going to make this like quite chunky. So even if you do break through those ones, um, get up here and, and go around here, and even break through these ones, you've then got this other other kind of like layer. So I have like a, a thing going on there. But yeah. Axa does want to install Conquest, but it's so hard. I have to update it. No, not at all. They've they've got an installer. So um, that's all I use. So uh, the Conquest Reforged Installer, you literally, if I get onto it, um, it looks like. Oh, can I open up another instance of it? I can't. Oh, that's annoying. Um, I would show you, but I'd have to close Minecraft, and it takes a while to load up. You literally click on it, and um, and then it downloads it for you. The only thing you have to do is you have to manually update your maps when when it comes out. So like from 1.10 to 1.12, but they give you a they give you an update for it. So you literally just click on it. Say what map it is, and then it will convert it for you over to it, and then you load it up in the new game. It takes a copy of it, so if it if it messes up, it doesn't break it or anything. It's brilliant. It's absolutely brilliant. Um. So yeah. Anyway, the the castle that I've been building is all the way over here, all the way over this way. How's it going, Apple Armor? What am I working on today? Uh, thumbnail looks good. It's very basic thumbnail. Um. But yeah, we're going upstream. Here we go. This is where I've been building. So literally last night, I just I wanted to build something, and I was going to do some stuff for Hemberg, and then I, I ended up just flying around. You know, like when you just walk around when you're not like thinking, feeling like doing anything. I just did that. How's it going, Emma Gow as well? Emma Gow, Philip Larson as well. Um, but yeah, I just, just walked around, and did that, and kind of like decided to start building. And then an hour and a half later, I had this kind of like idea. So people are going to instantly hate it because it's like the freaking Fort Scalar thing. Where, you know, technically, soldiers can get around the back and can come in and can probably, you know, break in or whatever and, and get across here. I mean, you, you'd be able to, like, throw a little rope from there and, and get on and go, Whoa. Oh, well, excellent, I'm in the castle now. Ha <laughs> ha! I'll go into my, you know, thing like that. But, um, you know, you never know. I don't think so. So, Primitive Panther says, uh, still use the Yarrowin for your own builds as well. Pretty perfect map for just about everything. Thanks, man. Um, please feel free to share some uh, pics on, on Twitter. I really do enjoy like seeing what people have built with it. There's some pretty incredible stuff that kicks my ass. Um, so, please do. Uh, just tweet at me. It's, it's always good. Um, Theo Rana wants more Star Wars builds. I can't be asked for Star Wars builds at the minute. I'm going to do... Queen Anne's Revenge is the next kind of like big tutorial that I'm working on. Uh, once I've got that and done it in default, I'll, I'll probably look at doing the 2 to 1 scale Millennium Falcon. Uh, but the really big stuff like Star Destroyers, man, I don't think it's worth it. They, they don't get enough views for it. Ah. 
Uh, do you, if you want to fly faster, use spectator mode? Yeah, yeah, man, definitely. No, no. I usually use that for flying around, like, quickly. It's just that, since this is literally, um, well, it's upstream. It's literally here, so it's it's kind of like this pass, this, this kind of, like, mountainy river pass. We've got this main one here, and obviously we've got one down here. But it's this, like, river pass, and like, I've, I thought that would be a really good place to put a... But so I mean, it actually, it actually comes from Skyrim where I got the idea of doing this like tower thing. And I went into Skyrim and had a look at it, and it looks so crap. It's just that that river where you go out of uh, White Run and walk down, and then there's just like a, a tower and another tower, and there's bandits on it. And I looked at it and went, I'm not basing any of it off of that, but except the idea of this bridge going over it. That was about it. Um, but yeah. Uh, Exodus does. Do you have to download anything else to make it work? Like uh, you do a sky. Um, Java, I think, probably. But if you if you play Minecraft, you've already got that. So it's not not too bad. And to be fair, Java's pretty easy to install. Um, right, it's very easy to install, actually. I installed it on two servers yesterday. Sad to. Which is weird that it wasn't there. How's it going to see a Ralba? Beyond's Play World is trying to advertise, which is not good. Don't do that, Beyond's Play World, Plain World. Um, <laughs> yeah, what else we got? Uh, yeah, see your abas. Oh yeah, I've do that. Ah. So I'm a bit, bit crazy now. Sorry, I'm trying to catch up on the chat, and then I'll, I'll get kind of like to actually build something. Luna Lotus, how's it going? John Island as well. John Smith, show full screen map. Uh, full screen map for location, please. Oh man, that's like. This is like it. This is as this is as far back as it zooms. Um, however, however, there is technically a way around it. So give me two seconds. Uh, ah, Wix. Wix is probably the best place to go. Right. So if we we're on Wix, click on Kingdoms. This is the map that we've got. So it's in Aurelia. God, this is this is where it's. Should we always get rid of that? <laughs> is there actually any way to get rid of that or not? No, you can't even close it. That's really annoying. Ugh. Right, so yeah, in a radio Oh well actually I was on a page that had a radio on it, didn't I? Uh it might not be on there. Let's see any No, it will be on there. Yes, yeah, so it's still on a radio. That's that's Hemberg on this bit. And it's actually here. So it's this little bit down there. Dine map, yeah, I should get Dine map or something, but I haven't got it. Um actually no, do I have another map somewhere else? Yeah, I'll have a look. I'll have a look for my files. I'm sure I've got another map somewhere else. Ah. Here we go. Here's one I made earlier. Well, not really made earlier. Here's one that I got earlier, which is, um... It's a bit buggy, actually. It doesn't, wasn't looking right. There we go. Is this one better? The smaller one. Problem is, right, this is a render from it. There we go. This is better. Right, so this is the entire map as it stands right now, including what I built on Hamburg. So just to render out from it. So it's all the way down here that they're going to be building. So that's that's whoop, that's Hamburg. And uh, we're going to be building here. These, these mountains across this little bit here. So that's where we're actually building. There we go. So that's the bit. Hopefully that helps. Okay, it really does like it takes a while to load, but it actually really does like load right in. Brembo Huda could fix that weak spot in the castle. It's really difficult because um you know it's just really difficult. So I don't know if I want to. <laughs> it's one of those things, isn't it? Like Minecraft is it's it's definitely not a palace type. It's going to be like a fortification. I mean, because I could have just like built it all the way up here, right? Uh, and this would have been a pretty good spot. But if I built it up here, I couldn't have the cool bridge thing going across to it, unless I made it huge. So I mean, the only other way would be to literally like curtain wall it up. Even if I made a curtain wall going across like here and going all the way up, I make it absolutely massive. But if I make it absolutely massive, I I don't I don't know. I don't really want the massive one. You know? I I don't know. But yeah, um, yeah. Little Lotus loves the roof design. It's so freaking weird. It is such a weird roof design. Um, 
I wanted to do something that I've never done before and I had no idea what it was going to look like. All I had in my mind was pointy and wood on the outside bit is like an outline. That was it. And uh, I'm actually pretty happy with it. I mean, it's got this like curviness to it, which I, I quite like. Um, but like, it's still quite pointy. <laughs> I think. <laughs> it's just a bit different. But anyway. Uh, turn to gold. Actually, building this, uh, building uh, on my city, a Hamburg-style town. Oh man, that'd be cool. Please feel free to post some pictures, man. I want to see. How's it going, Mister Mime? Big Mac as well. Big Mac's back in the house. Dark Wolf as well. Ah, Gensung, when you finish them up, you should go into World Painter, load up the level .dap, and open up the 3D view and export a 3D map. Yeah, I could definitely do that. That sounds really good, actually. I might do that again song when I when I finish Hamburg. Just load that up and do a picture of Hamburg, because that'd be pretty cool. But then again, actually no, no, it doesn't render the um, mod blocks, does it? So you can't actually see it. Yeah. So I don't know. Who else we got as well? We got Diker as well. Captain Vietnam is in the house. So we're going. How's it going? We got Doman, Coolman, Y Two uh, Y2, so YouTube. Yeah. Lusting or the Hunter. As well, what age was the castle built, and uh, what's its current use? Well, that's that's a very valid points, Apple Armor. I don't know. I wanted it square. I had two ideas, which was square towers this time and pointy roofs. That was it. So that's what we've got. Uh, to be fair, All right. So I think if we do some like like gate type thing here. So yeah, that's that's kind of like what we've got. You know, it kind of works for that. I think. Right, let's actually start. Yeah, start building something. You know, I kind of want. I wonder if behind all of this, I don't like the stone stone brick on here. I think I just painted it instead. Uh, I kind of want to bring this forwards because then we can have some sort of. Well, I kind of want to bring something forwards so we can actually shoot down. You know, something where they can. Over something that's the floor under. It depends on actually what the floors are going to be like design wise. Hmm, that's true. And we're going to bring these out as well. I think we do. We need to make it pop a little bit because it's not at the minute like at all. So, and obviously these are just like placeholders, really. Uh, if we do something like that, then get out another block. I mean, coming up with the main design is probably the biggest thing I think out of all of it, isn't it? Do we do something similar to what we did before with um, the ones where you actually have these like, we actually shoot down, you know? So you stood, stood, stand here and they can shoot down. Maybe. Alright, for the time being, let's put these on. So in between these, we're going to do something like that or. Oops. Let's give this a go. So if we got this, we can actually shoot down through these ones, which is good. Um, I think we don't need that to be that kind of like curve. I think we need it the other one. There we go. Right, let's put a mossy one in that bit. That bit. Yeah, because then we can put that in there. And this obviously is a <laughs> is rubbish, but apparently I've just, just deleted the entire block for that one. That was useful. Okay, so if we had if we had this, do I actually want to do something different than what I'm thinking of in my head, which is go with like proper kind of like um, matriculations, you know? Uh, which is if we if we do that kind of thing, we can actually do this, not that. Uh, we can do something like that, that. I'm wondering, can we do like a? Hmm, okay, that looks completely different than what I was expecting. I should do that. That allows you to shoot down, doesn't it? Right, I don't know. I don't know. 
Uh, Wolf says, uh, the Dark Wolf, not Dagger Wolf. <laughs> um, says, did I know that uh, Monsterfish is going to release the new Conquest text pack today? You're watching the stream yesterday. I didn't know that. Oh, thank you very much for sharing. How's it going, Manawa? Sorry, I'm a little bit behind on everyone. Um, uh, Luna Lotus, use the same roof style. Cool scan, yeah, it's not a problem. Um, pretty much, the main thing about it is there's a lot of stairs and there's a lot of slabs, so I don't know if you want to like grab a screen grab, it might be easier, but um, these are stairs. So you've got the stairs part of that, then you've got a stair there, then a vertical slab's going across the top, then stair, vertical slab, and it goes up, so I don't know, feel free to. Um, it's not a problem, obviously you can't do it in vanilla, that's the only thing. Because I was thinking about it, I was thinking actually this is kind of cool. I wonder if we can actually do something. But um, give me a shout if that's if you need some more screens or anything like that. If you just say like you want the top bit or whatever, uh, that's not a problem. That's the easiest thing to do. Ah. Hey, Bogdan Milowelski, Milowelski. Subscribed. Got Dougie Drew as well. How's it going, Dougie? So I don't know about this. I don't know about this at all. I think the only way we can actually do it is if we have. Yeah, and if we're going to do that, we might as well go like these, shouldn't we? Yes, yeah, so maybe we actually do something along those lines, but you know, bring it out a little bit. Maybe the whole, not bring it out. Bring it around. So I think if you can shoot down, that's a big bonus, right? This bit I'm actually going to leave because I think I'm going to bring it forwards for this like whole uh, thing. Um, definitely. But I don't know. Yeah, my my idea with this was that they would this this kind of like castle type thing would protect this. Well, not really protect this road. It's more like a toll type thing, isn't it? Really, because you've got the whole river um, that then they could probably pay a toll for. You'd have obviously have police boats, medieval police boats on there. Um, but if you were trying to actually have, like, bring trade down through, this would be, like, the perfect place to control it. Like, the actual trade through the river. Because you literally have got control of it, going all the way down and into the swamplands, and from there out to everywhere. This looks dreadful, this this bit here. I need to sort that out at some point. Um, but at least, yeah, you can actually see through there. So that was my idea. And for this, the road actually goes underneath it. So you could technically, you know, be shot down from here. But there's no reason the soldiers couldn't come out shoot down. They can see far enough to know that there's people on the road or not. So they'll be able to shoot down. Um, and whenever I sort this road out it would look a lot better. But even when you get to here then you have this whole tower sticking out and you go down there. So even if you're approaching it from this side you can have this weird tower which will probably get blown up with like a catapult pretty easily but that doesn't matter. Um, and then underneath here you'd then have to go through the main gates and we'd have something. That's my idea from it. Uh, but yeah. Uh, again, success. Did I ever get a chance to upgrade my PC? No, nah, I haven't been able to. I've just paid off the mortgage instead. Been really boring. Yeah. I've been really boring. <laughs> Which, I mean, it's totally worth doing, you know? I don't see any other thing. It's like we could do some. I always find that this is the most difficult part of actually building it. Right castles and stuff like that is getting whatever style that you've got that's well it's probably not in your head because it's not in my head anyway I have no idea what I'm actually what I want it to look like I have absolutely no clue that's probably where I'm going wrong actually you know you know we could do something like that couldn't we we could do something else I don't know drawbridge Razor Dawn drawbridge would be a very good idea I mean, we could actually do it this one here, because I thought this looked awkward as hell. I think you're totally right. We need a drawbridge. Because that is a good enough pillar, right? So if we get rid of this stuff... Oh man, I know what I forgot. I know what we're not doing. We're not actually recording this. I started doing this as a time lapse. So give me two secs. I'm going to have to like totally back out of this. I mean, this doesn't really matter that we've got that. Let me, let me just close this quickly. And we can actually do it at a start time, uh, recording it as a time lapse as well. Because otherwise the video's not going to look very good if, like, you know, only like 
a couple of minutes of it are in there. And unfortunately, when we do time lapses, I have to turn off shaders just to make it faster, so I can do like the extreme um, render distance. So we'll see. How's it going, real Aaron? We've got Sevaloy. Who's speaking of Russian? Excellent. Prince Panther is the wood in the roof of the vertical plank uh, spruce. It is absolutely. You got it all in one. Bank Dank. How's it going? <laughs> Nice name. Harvey, Harvey Carroll as well. It's a fair player. Um, what's the purpose of the castle? This story. Purpose is just to kind of like, you know, uh, not really. It's probably to protect and also, um, most likely, it's. Yeah. Yeah, it's to protect the cat. It's to protect this, like, river and the trade that goes through these, like, mountainy bits. So this is kind of like mountain pass. That kind of that kind of thing. But, um, yeah. We'll see. Right. Okay. There we go. If it's, on f if it's on extreme, then we can just let it all load up. Um, it just takes a while to load up, you know. It's just the way it is. Uh, more layers of defense equals more sexiness. It does, indeed. Yeah, you're absolutely right. So, yeah, I think drawbridge is a really good idea. Uh, Dougie Drew has just said the bridge is really flat. It, it really is. Yeah, I know. I, I noticed that. Well, I, it's not that I noticed that. Um, oh, my God. What is with the lag? That's weird. I think it's just because it's loading up. Um, yeah, I did I did kind of like, after I built it and I looked at it with shaders, I just went, yeah, that, it doesn't look great. So I think what we'll probably do, um, at the minute it goes to like this bit here. We could, I think instead we have it going down. So I think naturally they would have it going down and then we have it like linked up to this road. So if we do that, that would make it look a lot cooler. Uh, and also again, defense wise, if you got people like marching uphill to try and uh, uh, you know attack it from this angle, which would be pretty stupid if they got a drawbridge, um, then that's the other thing as well, isn't it? You know, it's an, it's another thing. So definitely, definitely good idea. Don't we've always struggle with castles. Kind of a good challenge. It's one of those things. I'm not very good at them. Uh, I really enjoy building them though. They're they're really fun to build. But yeah, I totally know what you mean. So I'm thinking like. Might go with those. I think I've done that before. That's anything. Oh yeah, and I put that in there, didn't I? Yeah, because that obviously then makes it look kind of cool and everything on this side. I mean, and that's a pretty <laughs> pretty big gap down there. But but I mean, it would allow you to shoot down, which is good. You know, that's a, that's a big big bonus. How's it going, Skip? Good to see you. It's got uh, 92. How's it going, 92? It's gonna come nine twenty two. Yeah. You like the Queen's Anne's, uh, Queen Queen Anne's Revenge stream? Yeah. Um, we've got to finish that at some point. We've totally got to finish it. So we will hundred percent get onto that. Have they fixed this? Oh my god, I forgot they've actually fixed this. Man, it's annoyed me so much. I I didn't even notice that they fixed it. It's pretty bad on my part. I tell you what, there we go. Yeah, because then you can kind of shoot from there. <laughs> right, okay, so if we go with a drawbridge, right? I usually go with spruce for drawbridge, and I don't really know why. It's just because I quite like a sprucey texture, like the. There we go, that one there. Oh, yeah, but then we got the whole other spruce, haven't we? There. Yeah. Yeah. Don't ask why I'm making weird sounds. I'm just just am in that kind of like mood. Post work, it's a Friday kind of mood. Obviously, is uh, is what's going on. Well, I'd probably be like there, wouldn't it? I reckon this would go into some sort of like groove thing. Oops. So if we like get. You know, like something up up here, or didn't really have to cut into there, did it? Yeah, I'll we'll have something like that, and that looks terrible. But you know, we'll we'll have something, um, and then it'll tie it in somehow. So if we're doing this whole thing, if we're actually lifting, that, I think actually that's a bit far away. Cause that's quite, <laughs> that's a, it's a huge drawbridge, isn't it? So I mean, we can always move it. 
the thing is, I don't want to move it closer because, um, well, you can kind of climb up this bit and if we, like, move it more... I mean, we could, can we? Yeah, we could. To technically move it out to, like, you know, here or whatever. We actually have, you know, this whole thing going on. Whether they have like a weird thing like this. I have no idea. Just be throwing ideas out there <laughs> to see what happens. You know, something like that will then have obviously the chain that comes down and everything. Alright, okay. Big man, the only problem with Skyrim castles is that they lack total f lack of physics and defense. Well, I, I agree. Uh, admittedly, what's that? Dawnguard one? Man, that is so bad. I actually really liked watching, um, oh, what's that guy's name? Uh, the guy that does the really, he does like videos on castles and stuff and says matriculations. Shadowversity. Is it Shadowversity? Something like that, isn't it? It's Shadowversity. I'm pretty sure it's Shadowversity. I did enjoy watching this thing on the sky. Uh, Markov was actually pretty funny as well, to be fair. That was, that was pretty bad. So maybe we just move this in. I'm, I'm, what I'm trying to figure out, right? If we connect it in here, maybe we have it even closer. You build another gate at the other end of the drawbridge. That would also be a good idea, wouldn't it? You'd probably have that. You'd probably have something over here as well. Even if it's just something that's just got um, like a portcullis or something like that. That would make it sense, wouldn't it? Yeah. What colours would do it? Definitely. Right, so if we move that back again. Because, you know, that's what we're doing. Um, move this back again. Delete all this that we put in initially. Um, except there. Maybe have that on there. What did I do with this then? Oh, so I pushed it back one and not actually pushed it up there. What am I doing? Yeah, shove that in there. Shove that in there. There you go. Get the basic kind of stuff going on. Like it, it doesn't need to be that big. I don't think so, anyway. And then if we have it, like, here, or even, even going back to, like, here, you know? Then, if we connect it up... Have I not got... I've got rid of the other block. Probably when I was picking up all those other stuff, really. I don't know. Uh, so Bart just doesn't, don't watch him anymore. I find him really annoying and arrogant. He has got quite arrogant, hasn't he? I didn't like that whole, you know, that response type video type thing he did. So he didn't have to do that. He didn't have to go, oh, well, I'm right because of blah, 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 blah. Uh, you know, totally fair enough. You know, there isn't much on, on uh, was it to do with lever armor or something? But, you know, I don't think he had to do that video. He really didn't, but he did anyway, because he wanted to whatever reason. So this is the only thing, like, where does this go? And that's going to end up going into here. Well, if it goes into here, it can then go down, can't it, into, like, a chain room? It's just, the only thing is, we then lose the ability to have, like, a portcullis type thing. Unless we do have that portcullis, you know, on the other side. Yeah, that, and then it's fair enough. Yeah. Hmm. Whoops. I want to delete that. Not that there. Yeah, there we go. Love these chains. So, I mean, yeah, we can have something like there, but I would have liked it to be a little bit lower. I don't know. Yeah. Ah, what's the name of the castle? Good, good thinking, Tyler Cooey. No, I, no idea. I have no idea. Absolutely none. <laughs> Absolutely no idea what the name of this castle is. I don't even know where the floors are going to go, to be fair. I mean, I just started building it out of random boxes and just adding boxes together until I was kind of happy with it. I mean, there's a tip inside. It's really messy. 
Um, where is the floors? So I think we need wooden floors rather than what we got at the minute. So if we put in wooden floor like here or whatever, I'll probably do like a nice mix of not those two. <laughs> nice mix of definitely not those two. Because unfortunately, all my mixes are screwed because of the. I, I used to love this texture. I used to love it so much. I hate it now. I seriously hate it. I can't stand it. It really annoys me. So all of my brushes that I had before for like cool roofs and things like that have kind of like gone. I'm going back to like these type of things. Um, right, anyway. There's not really a thing they would uh, do with at least one arch on a wall. Uh, I'm missing everything now. I'm missing the whole thing. How's it going, Ryan the 13th? Sorry, but I'm, I've missed the conversation completely. So Captain Vietnam also drawbridge on the other side. So you're saying like drawbridge on this side? Technically could do, you know? Hmm, I don't know. Interesting. Resident, so I think it's good he addressed it, but he could have been better. Yeah, yeah, he could have been. Yeah, that's true, yeah. It's one of those things, isn't it? <laughs> you know? It's one of those things. Uh, Tyler's saying, let me recommend from hold. From hold. Depends. They're not so well. They're the the kind of like people that are in Aurelia are less Nordic. They they have got like Nord uh, from everybody. All the humans are from Nordic descent basically, except the ones that came from, uh, well, like an African type kingdom. And oh, uh, also the Japanese type people as well. Those obviously aren't from Nordic descent. That'd be really weird. But um, yeah. So from hold, I th I quite like the like hold. You know, hold definitely works as the ending, obviously. Uh, Nicolan saying uh, Westgrave Castle. So yeah, Bram, you're saying drawbridge on the other side. What do you guys think? Drawbridge on the other side? And a gatehouse in the middle. I'm not going to go with a gatehouse in the middle, man. Can you imagine that as well? I mean, that'd be that'd be mega defense. I think if this was the only way to get to the castle, totally. But because there's also this way... Ah, oh, shit. I'm doing something that, um, that Shadowversity would hate. <laughs> I've got I've got the perfect place here for a uh, for like a, 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 a what's it called what's it called like a, a, like gatehouse type thing haven't I right here yeah I have actually got a, pla a perfect place for one to have a portcullis there we go portcullis right I'm actually going to put a portcullis here because it is the perfect place to do it the only thing is we've got this like little I've got this really rubbish little wall thing because I was just like, uh, uh, I want to force people this way, so I'll put this tiny wall thing in. Uh, so there's only that's that's the only other problem. But I guess if we actually put a port portcullis in here, we can actually bring this wall around, right, and connect into there. River hold, Captain Vietnam. That's a pretty good one. That's a pretty good one. Who else thinks about river hold? River hold sounds very because it's literally it's on a river. That sounds like a natural name. Miss my no draw bridge on the other side. Gatehouses everywhere. They pretty they pretty much would do it, but yeah, that's pretty boom, you know. You know what I'm saying. Uh, Dove car. What happened to High Guard? Have you ever finished it? No, I haven't. I haven't finished it. I just I wanted to work on a project I could finish, and then I started Hamburg, and I haven't been able to finish that yet. <laughs> oh dear. How's it going, Ali TV? It's got uh, Alexandre Incrito. Riverhold. Who's I'm I'm I think Riverhold is a really damn good name. <laughs> Razor Dawn. Uh, I'm, I'm gonna have to say this like like a gangster as well with Razor Dawn. Yo dog, I heard you like gatehouses, so I put a gatehouse on your gatehouse so you can gatehouse while you gatehouse. <laughs> yeah. So you know, yeah, I think Riverhold definitely sounds good. Right, so that's just River hold. Uh, right. Obviously, it's not actually Germanic. So I think, yeah, we bring that around there, because because this is actually the weak point, really. I, I 
Don't tell me about the whole thing up here, right? If you ignore all the stuff up there, you know, the whole rocks falling down, the whole... Uh, technically, you could get an I mean, I don't know how you're going to get a bloody army up here. That's the other thing, like... In reality... You might be able to get some people up... And create a path and, and maybe... Yeah, technically you can get in. Yeah, you could, you could probably get in. Let's just say the assassins have done that or something, you know? But yeah. There we go, cool. Riverhold, thanks guys. That was pretty awesome. How's it going, Puff Productions? Who else haven't I said hello to Joel and Tila as well? Uh, yeah. So it literally holds a river. It makes perfect sense, doesn't it? Yeah. Cool. Zamaun, how's it going, man? It's a new product. Yeah, I, I started building yesterday. Um, just wanted to... I don't know, it was weird. I was flying around and I, I saw this area and went, I want something there. Loaded up Skyrim because it reminded me of somewhere. Uh, then I closed Skyrim because it, it looked terrible. So, um, so, at one point I'll show people the actual thing of of where uh, it was kind of like inspired by. It's not really inspired by, is it? Well, it kind of is, isn't it? Yeah, it is. It is inspired by that. That's what made me think about doing something going across a bridge. So, I don't know. Kind of works. God, that's going to be a weird thing, isn't it? Going down that way. Right, so... What I'm trying to do at the minute is putting down a floor, obviously, for what I'm sure is a good reason. Maybe. I'm not really too sure if it's actually a good reason or not. Uh, that'll do. And up there. Okay. So I actually wanted to go down here to have a look at where this comes out. So that's the... I mean, would they... We got enough room to put a portcullis in. I don't think we do from here, not from this side. It'd be perfect if we had a portcullis on it, but I think the reality is if we do end up having a drawbridge, well, we've got a drawbridge here, if we end up having even a gatehouse or a portcullis on that side, um, people wouldn't attack from this side. So I think we don't need a portcullis on this side, but on this side, down here. We punch through this randomly. Down here, though, potentially we could have a portcullis. Um, maybe. Uh, yeah. Dark Wolf could do a kill box in that part. Yeah, I think we do. This would be a pretty good kill box, wouldn't it? You know, we we do build. I think we are going to have to build up a wall going around this bit. bit. Uh, if we want to make it still keep it quite square, we could keep it quite square, but I, I don't mind like curving in a wall. Um, or something, you know, it doesn't really matter. If we're gonna, gonna bring in a wall though, I feel like I need to go this way more. Um, to, to make the shape more interesting, because actually, yeah, it's not the most interesting, so I mean, it could come somewhere up here or so. I don't know. I don't know, we'll have a look at, uh, look at it. Maybe 30 gates, yeah? I don't know. Have a look. New stuff is always great as long as Hamburg isn't forgotten. Obviously. Yeah. Obviously. No, this, this, it's actually, I mean, it's literally just a little bit north from Hamburg. I mean, look, Hamburg's here. Still literally in, in mind. And so it's it's that river that goes past it, the whole thing. It's from there. Which is kind of cool. Right. If we get. Yeah. Because I'm just going to shove some wood in it. Probably isn't going to be wood for that bit. Um, so, I mean, floor-wise, I think, because this is only a couple blocks, there's no point putting a floor in here. So I think maybe we actually have like a, a hall. So maybe this is going to be the hall-type area. Um, or, you know, you come in at this raised bit, and actually it's all the diff different weird la la layers or levels or whatever. Because it actually is, like, when you go up onto this bit, you know, this level here is pretty, like, standard. Uh, for this bit, but actually then you can go up. Uh, admittedly, I put it in cobblestone because that's what I ended up using. So that's got this kind of side bit, and then you go up to the next level, which has then got this little bit here, and then you can go down again. So I've tried to like put quite a few different levels on it. Um, whether they're useful or not, I have no idea. But, yeah. There we go. So this tower as well. Just got to make sure I don't forget about it, because uh, otherwise I will. 
Hmm. I was going to say, that's at a different level, but it actually doesn't matter. So, I mean, we can totally bring that one down and then have that as a way, way in. I could whitewash the castle to make it more colourful. I could do. I mean, it does it does blend in quite a bit, but I think probably when we get start getting more detail-y type stuff in it, it might help it pop, I'm, I'm hoping. And I can't do that, damn it. <laughs> That's so annoying. Yeah, I'd, I'm hoping that that'll work. You know, we can't even do like... Because it's not really that big, you can't do like those kind of things. Or... Oops. Those kind of things. Just looking at it going, hmm. Is that a better way to... You know, do stuff? I don't know. How's it going, Fried Fluctation? Got you and an hour and low. Uh, making this one, making your own. Med medieval City, cool. Sounds good. Send some pictures. Pictures are ultimate. Right, so I mean, if we have, and, and there's a reason why I'm trying to plan the inside by the way guys, um, like as we're doing random bits of elsewhere, it's so that we can actually get the, if I can get the floors done, then I can get the rest of the stuff done, you know, the whole shooty holes, wherever they, wherever they are, oh, there it is, shooty holes, so I can get those done. So I'm thinking, oh wow, this is really tiny, isn't it? Uh, maybe get that up to there, so we have this as quite a big... Well, it's going to have to be there, isn't it? I can't go anywhere else. So we have that, like, there. That leaves this really small bit for this area. Which is also the perfect place to put in this. And probably one of those as well. And probably even on this side. <laughs> is this a good idea? In reality, is this a good idea? And you know, I can shoot there. I can shoot nowhere. You can't shoot down, so I mean, I think realistically, that's probably a a one kind of place to shoot type of thing. I don't know. Maybe that'll do it. Mm-hmm. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm even looking at that and going, actually, I'm not sure if I like that. Do we go with a hole? You know, this thing. And then if we go with this thing, do you end up going, you know, pushing it back? This is the thing I've always wondered with this. Like, do you end up doing like this, well, so you can get right up close, you know? Or do you go the other way? Cause, I mean, that just makes it look like really tiny little slit type thing, whereas obviously the other, the other thing isn't. Yeah. But at least if we go with... The, uh, I'll tell you what, we'll just go with that for now and we'll end up tweaking it as we go along. Because that at least means we can then get onto these bits. Uh, even if we don't do that gate house bit. Oh, yeah. This actually goes into here, doesn't it? Okay. So we're going to need some sort of way into this. Uh, and then if we go into here, we won't put one there. Here? Yeah, yeah there apparently. Yeah. And maybe there. So actually go on those sides instead, rather than there, because then on the outside it'll look better. And I'll, I'll vary it these later on, I think. It's one of those. Okay. And uh, what about above it? Yeah, because we want it on that floor, won't we? So we'll go out. Yeah, I get those kind of things, and I'll I'll sort out this top bit. But if we have, you know, obviously I have a way, probably have a way in on this side. Really, it's quite low. <laughs> really, is quite low, isn't it? And we'll probably end up getting rid of that one because it will end up tying into something else. Uh, also, it doesn't really serve any function. But these will. Even one on the side uh, probably actually doesn't serve a function, but at least gives us an idea of it. Uh, it gives us a bit of an idea of everything going on. Hmm. 
Hmm. <sighs> yeah, cast stuff those slits is historically arrow gun windows. They do, I know, indeed. I I don't know. I I've never been keen on this this kind of like thing, and it is because it's so small. And it it makes perfect sense why it's so small. It's just that when you look at a castle, it doesn't make it as defined in Minecraft. I know that's really bad. That I'm looking at the the look of it, but you know, yeah. You think the big ones look weird, Genzong? I don't know. Whitehold Castle? We've already gone with Riverhold, man. Riverhold. Obviously not said like that. They'll have some different voice, which is more... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what... I don't know what they'll sound like, to be fair. But yeah. But yeah, we'll have a look. So yeah, we need to... Right, okay. So if I just, for the time being, just shove this on just so it looks less flat. Cause it's annoying me a little bit. Uh, now the only thing is that we went with the other ones. These ones, okay. And then, what do I do for these then? Oh, it, I just ended up putting that in front of it. Okay, that's fine. Just wonder if we do that there. And then I'm probably going to put a block, aren't I? Yeah, put a block in there. I don't know, some of like that. This ones would work. Uh, only would work for lighting. Okay. Even I can hit the defenders through those big holes. <laughs> I know, but I, I like the look of them more. It looks so much better, I think. Personally, I, I think it looks better. I mean, maybe you guys, you know, have different opinions on it, but I don't know. We can always change it. You know? All right, all right, guys. Right, so in terms of them, do we want to do this when we haven't gone on this side? That way, or do you want it the other way around? Which is like... I can't get through the thing. Like that, you know? What? Which one do you want? So we've got... Option A. And to be fair, if I did option A, I would probably do... Some stairs as well, you know? I'd end up doing like this. Whoops. Whoops. Do something like that, so then they can... Actually, that looks pretty good. Pretty sold on that already. <laughs> I am actually already sold on that. It's like kind of like idea. It makes it look a lot better. And obviously those will go there, and that will go there. So that's something like that. Does that look better? That looks better, doesn't it? That really does look better. Yeah. I think this one, rather than this one, even though this one does make kind of like you know, the other way around would be better. You think this would be better? Well, this will be better. Right, let's go. One or two. That's what you guys need to tell me, okay? That's about the look of it. Don't, don't you know. Maybe. <laughs> I've got some people saying option A. Option B. A or B. I mean, it's the, the definition of this one just looks makes it look a hell of a lot better. So much better, in fact. But, you know, it's whatever you guys think. Shakespearean says option A, yep. Jacob B says one, one. Most people say one, some people say two. Stitch and Sam plays, how's it going, man? Good to see you. Option B is more realistic. Yeah, I know, it is, definitely, but... Pff, see? Two looks so boring. See? Two looks boring. Gundam Tanaka says zero. I have no idea what that is. <laughs> All right. I think, in general, it looks like A is 1. So, I mean, if I was shooting, right, I'd be pretty happy with that. Because you get, from here, like, looking out, you get a pretty good a pretty good, you know, view of it, don't you? I'd say. And if I go inside, up here, there we go. But then again, you get the same over here as well, don't you? You kind of, it's just you're not, you haven't got a, as wide of an angle, I don't, I don't think. I think you've, like, 
got less of an angle, even though it's it's probably more realistic. Option one looks better and looks allows, uh, allows archers to pivot their arm. It does, yeah, you, you, that's true. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Mimikyu says option zero, the big windows. These ones, yeah, yeah. Two is barely visible. It is, isn't it? That's the thing. It's got to be visually quite nice, isn't it? Really, oh, it doesn't have to be. Noth nothing has to be anything really. I'm not looking at this and just going, wouldn't they just like link over to this one or something? Maybe not. <laughs> uh, no, we'll see. Right, okay. Alright. We'll sort that out in a second. So I just started looking at this and going, I've got to finish this bit. There you go, get that in there. Do that. 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 Even though it's completely useless. Yeah, I'll put that in there. Can't put one there. Alright, well that doesn't really matter if we can't put one on there. So I know that'll do for now. I think we're going to have to revisit it though. Because I like looking at it and just going, I don't really like it. Um, but I do like this bit. So, yeah, I, d I don't like the top of this at all. Really not liking it, so I've got to come up with something else for it that kind of like fits with the whole style and everything like that. So I think it's still going to have like these, you know, coming down. It's just top bit. I don't like it. I just don't like it. Uh, but yeah, we will have those going down there for sure. There we go. So something like that. Get that in there. I will do something else. I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> Nicolan says, uh, add a troll under the bridge. Could do. Uh, troll hut, though. A uh, whole hut. I always think trolls under the bridge aren't like these kind of like big bridges. I always think of them as like, those like little bridges, you know? Uh, I don't think of them having a hut underneath it as well, but. You know. That's just what I think. Doesn't doesn't mean that's what it is, you know. Right. Okay. So, if we go with this this kind of like style that we got here, let's just grab these blocks. We can at least put this in, you know. Uh, annoyingly, it's gonna be there, but uh, we could. No, we need to have that facing. I think if anything, you're gonna have it facing down. Oops, <laughs> aren't you? Realistically, you will. Um, the other, th other thing is, can we do some actual stuff with this to make it like more interesting? You know, like this. I can like curve it in a bit, but but you know, kind of still keeping it boxy. Oh dear, those of those of those need mapping sorting out. I do love this wheel. I would not be able to build without this wheel anymore. Um, I've actually downloaded. I've actually downloaded the pocket version of Minecraft for my phone. <laughs> it's such a nightmare. God, I'm struggling so much with it. It's just so difficult to actually use the game. You know, so difficult. What if you integrated ramparts into the wall and support blocks of fence underneath? Uh, several blocks deep. Yeah, I mean that, that's another option as well, isn't it? Definitely. So Erebus, is the bridge finished? No, what we're going to do with the bridge... Uh, we've got to sort out the drawbridge of some kind. Going to angle it down. And probably put in some sort of gatehouse type thing. So when you actually do go onto it, there's like a small portcullis which will just stop you from being able to... Like, well the idea being that stop you from getting a, a battering ram or something through here. Admittedly, you're going to have to take it quite far. But that's the idea, you know. And then you'd get to here with your battering ram, and then you'd go, oh yeah, they've got a drawbridge. Yeah, and, and by that time, hopefully, they would have shot down fire at you. I mean, that's what I'm hoping my guys would do. Personally, that's what I would do. Shoot down fire. <laughs> Somehow. But yeah. And this is the other thing, if we do something like here, where we're actually going to the way. 
you know, and using these these, which might make it a little bit more interesting. So we can do stuff like this. I mean, to be fair, I think we can probably do that, can't we? Yeah, we won't want to, but we can do that. How weird does it look if I do this? Not terribly weird. You know? And if we do that, we can then put, you know, slabs on top. Obviously, I'm just using one material at the minute. I will variate, don't worry. Uh, but then you could have, you know, these could actually have something on top of them. So they stick out, don't they? Oops, that one there. Looks weird. Yeah, <laughs> uh, looks weird. Hmm. Very weird. But at the same time, this would be really good. You know, I, if I if I was an archer up here, I'd be able to just go ping, 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 ping. And you know, if I needed to, I could hide in here, sleep for a bit, and then back to it, ping. Maybe I'm ping from there, make it look like I'm loads of people from here. Ping, ping. I mean, that's a good angle. Invert it. Okay. We'll go the other way around. Yeah, I mean, could do that, couldn't we? Definitely. So, rather than that, it'd be... What? Oh, maybe... Uh, <laughs> there. There. And then here would be here. That's the inverted way. Oh, yeah, that does look better. That looks kind of like more like what we had before, but... You know. Without the, the block part of it. This is the only problem, not ha not having a, a good idea of uh, <laughs> of what I want it to look like doesn't help. And that does actually open up these as well, I quite like that. I quite like that, that's a good idea. Thank you very much, sir. So there we go, right, so if we do that... We then get this whole thing where we can shoot down here. We've also got these. Oh, if I go over to here, it's got this kind of like area here where we can shoot down as well, you know. And visually, I think that looks better as well. Yeah, visually, I think that actually does look better. Hmm. Seem good. Yeah, I think I think that does look good. Definitely. Thank you very much, Jacob C. I mean, the other thing... Well, now that I'm looking at it. The other thing, of course, is a wall. You know, you're actually using the wall text, uh, wall block to go between these two. So that gets you dead on the middle. I think that actually looks even better. That wall texture. Technically, we could actually even put those on the sides. Count those up. If we want to make it still keep it, have that like square look. Actually, that does look quite cool, doesn't it? I can't decide if I like, I want this uh, on the sides or not. Um, and yeah, it's going to be weird on these sides, but I'm not too bothered about that. Let's give it that. Let's do that for now. Uh, right, let's destroy this, and we'll start again with this bit now. We'll get there. We are definitely going to get there. Right, so if we've got that, we got these down here. Uh, obviously, this is a bit of a a weird thing, so we'll we'll kind of like leave that for now, because <laughs> whenever it's a weird thing, you just like you know just ignore that it even exists. That's the that's the easiest thing, right? Right, guys. Yeah, good. <laughs> you have no idea what you're going to do with it. And whatever we do here. Well, I mean, for here we could probably just put in like a, a thing like that rather than... That's not going to work at all. So you have something like that and then go around. It's very lumpy. That's not what we want. Something like that. I don't know. Something like that. Can I still shoot near the door? 
What you mean? What through here? I mean, up here? You mean? Like near the door? Oh yeah, from this bit. Um, from that bit you can't with the with the corner bit, but you can still do it from here. You've like got perfect shot down at it, you know. So that's pretty good. Uh, don't you want to ever add NPCs to it, Yeah, I, mean, I did start doing it. Um, I've got you know custom NPCs mod, and they all disappeared when I updated it from um on two different versions. It's really annoying. See, so, yeah, I mean, technically we can do. You know, we've got. Well, I don't want to put breasts on it. That'd be weird. <laughs> yeah, I can't have technically got all these different things. Parrot that looks like a di like a little dinosaur thing. Very good. Um, yeah, we have we have got stuff. Vex. They look freaky as hell. Holy moly. When did we get that thing? I don't know what that is. <laughs> but that is so damn scary. If, you, if that was real, that'd be scary. Yeah. Yeah, I do have custom NPCs. I just haven't, um... I haven't, like... Well, it's not that I haven't done anything with them. It's uh, they all got removed, so I need to add them all back in again, which is really kind of like a bit of a pain. But it's the way it is, isn't it? It's just the way it is. Right. So if we go for this, let's put in a probably got enough of that on there. Maybe we do it down here. There we go. So like that, and put that in there. I do quite like this on the sides. So I am going to go with that. Oops. On these. Wow. Tyler, thank you very much. It's a few big ones for the entertainment, inspiration, and Riverhold Troll. Yeah, thank you so much, Tyler. I'll let the things Here's speak. Here's a few big ones for the entertainment, inspiration, and the Riverhold troll. Damn, man. Um, Tyler, if you do have Discord, please do join our Discord. Um, and if you do, just post in the chat quickly and I'll I'll add you to our donators group. Um, unfortunately, that's the only thing I've got at the minute for donators. But at some point, maybe in the future, we'll have something else. I also need to like uh, pull this in, don't I? Because at the minute, it's like really... Uh, gravelly. Um, so if I put some more rock in there, then that'll work a lot better. But yeah, thank you so much. So you came up with the name and have also donated. That's amazing. Do you want to bring this back by one block? Because if we do, then we can at least get this in um, that little bit more. It's either that or I, I do bring this forwards. Because I am looking at this just going I, th I think I should bring this whole thing forwards. So I don't know. Type typical. Of course I remember you. I think I should bring this forwards. Let's just bring it forwards. We just get rid of that and don't go on that. Flint axe will do. Um, is it move one? It is in the yeah. That's how you do it. <laughs> I can remember. I was just like, uh, I've done this before. I can't remember this block at all. But yeah. All right. You don't have Discord. Ah, oh, man, that's all right. Don't worry about it. If you ever do get Discord, do give me a shout. That's the easiest way. Um, just because then we've got a channel and stuff. But um, don't worry about it if you don't. Um, it's just the way it is, you know. Orcs big navy invasion? What do you think? Oh, absolutely, yeah. I mean, orcs are going to be invading at some point. Uh, I was tempted to actually have on the way, you know, like, um, you know, as, I, as I'm building this, I was thinking, well, actually, do I, if I get around to do Investia up here and also Vaganbury on the coast, do I end up actually having some orcs invaded? I did really think about that and actually have them, you know, landed on, like, uh, well, this is going to have, like, a burnt village. So, I mean, we can actually have the burnt village and have actual orc ships in and around this area. Uh, the only thing is that I have got plans for like a quite a nice like town type area here on the north of Vestia, so I don't know. I don't know, we'll see. See what it's like. 
Oops. There we go. Let's let that go to there. Oh, no, not the lag. Yeah. I'm thinking matching towers beside the gate would look good. Uh, but I don't know if there's enough state space. Typically, I, I know what you're thinking. Um, but typically, I try to, or, or in general, you should try to make it as like asymmetric as possible. So make it like a bit random. But it's totally, it's, it's kind of like one of those things, isn't it? You can either have it like really nice and symmetrical or try and make it a little bit off. Admittedly, this, this tower I've got here is so small. You, I mean, it's a one block on inside. On the outside, it's like three blocks. <laughs> And then you got this one, which is a lot bigger, you know? Um, obviously, there won't be any down here, because it just doesn't make any sense, but... Yeah, it's just one of those, isn't it? Right, well, this this I'm pretty happy with. I, I really like this. Now that we've finally got around to doing it. So let's get... Let's also get the other one as well, this one. I think also get that one. Oh, should I vary it another time? Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Somebody subscribed, I think. I think that's what that sound was. I missed it, so I do apologise to that person. Yeah, so I don't know what we could do with this bit. Whether we um, oh, I punched a wall, a hole in the wall there. Um, where we you know, bring the stairs around the side instead, you know, because we got got this obviously. So we do something instead where it goes like and wraps around and and stuff. Um, to be f honest, this should probably be a wall anyway. Probably. Just put that in there. Uh, if we do that, then at least we can, you know, yeah, if we did something like this, then we can have this. And then we can do, oh yeah, here as well. Let's do that there. Right. That, 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 uh, and then those joiny bits. And for this one, actually that kind of works actually, does it? Kind of end it, doesn't it? Uh, type typical, um, what's the Discord code again? It's in the description. It's in the description. Because I can't remember it. <laughs> yeah, asking the wrong person, buddy. I, I can't remember anything. <laughs> uh, Jason Shepard, is this a map mod or a Minecraft editor? It's a custom map, um, and it's a mod. So it's a it's a Minecraft mod that's that we're actually using. Um, the custom map is is one that I created. Uh, you can download it for free, of course, because I don't believe in charging people th for things at all. I don't know if you can actually. I'm not sure if you are allowed to. Big Mac, make it a wooden stair, uh, stair so defenders can remove it if needed. Damn man, you are so right. Damn so right. So right. So so damn right. That makes perfect sense as well, doesn't it? Really. God. That and it will look better. I mean, so not only not only that, but it will actually look better. So now something like this. I can put the railing on it. Oh yeah, railing. Nothing better than a railing. <laughs> Maybe. There we go. Right, we can have a railing going to there. And then we'll probably put something in here. Something like that. Jim Bob, is this castle on a border? I think so. Um, we haven't really laid out the borders for this region. But I think so. I think it's going to be. Part of, it, part of it on a border. Ooh, what's this one? I've not seen this before, but that looks very nice for Roman stuff. At some point we'll get onto that, <laughs> I'm sure. Yeah. Yeah, there is a lot of 90 degrees angles on this uh, Dougie. There is. It's very 90 degrees. I kind of wanted it to be that way, though, because um, with High Guard we had really rounded kind of structures. Um, and with. Hi, uh, Hemburg. We've got quite, you know, the the towers are quite square, so I kind of 
feel that, uh, and uh, like the walls are still wavy, you know, which makes sense. But the, the gatehouses and the, the things are quite square. I kind of feel like rounded is more sophisticated. So that's why I've got for um, uh, Calandria, we're going to have it quite rounded, and also Vestia is quite rounded as well, because they've kind of had to develop those kind of uh, defensive things for going against the orcs, which is the kind of that's my thinking behind it. That's why I'm having it quite square. So it's almost like they're they're not as not as advanced in terms of um, their building. I know that sounds a bit crazy because you know they're all in the same goddamn place, but that's the reason that I've kind of gone for square around these areas is to try and make it feel a little bit more less. <laughs> I don't know. Does that make any sense? Does that make any sense? If it doesn't make any sense, let me know. No, oh, no lag. It's not good. But yeah, we're good. I must say, I think those are the best and most interesting rooms I've, um, I've ever made. I think so as well. They're really weird. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> uh, I do like it. That They are really weird. I, I'm quite happy with them. Happy with how they turned out, anyway. Right. Obviously, I need to vary all this. It's going to really annoy me without... If I don't, if I forget to variate it, you know, I do love how this texture goes like this. Really good. All right, here we go. So I'll leave that for now, and then we'll vary all that stuff later on. Uh, but that already brings it out a little bit. Oh yeah, we we're gonna fix this. That's why I got this piece of wood in my hand. Sometimes I just forget stuff, don't I? Uh, if I just go with the capital one, then I can put a, a stick down. And I've got a stick down, I can then, you know, do this whole thing. Put a block in. Oops, not that way around, that way. Yeah. Oh. That always happens, doesn't it? You know, like you start putting things in random places. Um, putting things down, you get something like that. There we go. That kind of works, and that that kind of mixes it up as well. That's really good. Cool. I can't remember who said that, but really good. Kind of like cool. Definitely. Ah, oh. Jim Bob. Will I have uh, small random stuff like caves and cottages, like in Skyrim, for example? Of course. Yeah. Um, if you see my earlier Vestia stuff, I mean we can. Uh, if I finish up this bit, I'll then I'll then stop the the kind of like recording bit and um, we're going to have a little wander around very you know for a couple of minutes or something, uh, and then probably end the stream because I need to make some dinner for me and the other half. So uh, that'll be that'll be good. So I mean, got to do that and chillax a little bit. Um, oh yeah, what what do you guys want for the next stream anyway? Do you want like more of this kind of like castly stuff? Um, or do you want something else? Do you want um, me to be working on Queen Anne's Revenge? That's another one as well, in which we need to do. Uh, or anything else? You know, is there is there anything that you guys are really like fanc fancying, like watching, or seeing me do, and us building up? Because I do want to get some building over the next maybe couple days, something like that. But obviously, I don't know what I'm, what you guys want, then it makes it difficult. <laughs> something like that. Lots of people in the same place geographically have very different levels of development. That's true as well, actually, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know what the hell this bit's for. I mean, this is a bit of a weird... And I, I guess it's, guess it's not, actually, because you can probably like look out. So this could be, like, you know, the quarters of the Lord or whatever his name is, you know, Lord Jeff. Um... Uh, it's not that big actually, but uh, he could have his quarters up here or whatever. You know, he doesn't have to be like a proper lord. He's got a pretty good castle. You know, there's, there's that, but it doesn't mean that he could. He always has to live there. It could just be a defense, defensive type castle. It's the other other thing, isn't there? Oh god, damn it! <laughs> I can't get in here. Uh. So Galadriel's perfectly. Uh, 
I prefer a video on Yarrowin, but don't mind. Um, okay, cool. More ships? Well, that would be the Queen's Under Revenge, of course. But yeah, I mean, it's one of those things, you know, we can continue on uh, with Hamburg. I really do want to finish Hamburg. You know, I'd, I'd love to actually just have it finished, because I found out that you can, can do some pretty cool stuff with... Um, well, obviously with... Uh, uh, ah, replay mod. Um, including like actually having like a, a proper like track type thing and then actually having that between worlds so it means that I can do uh, like a, a time lapse of well not really a time lapse a flyover before and after and like have it fade in and do some cool stuff so I really want to do that you know I think that would look really good <laughs> oh dear I've got pink wall down there I need to colour that in definitely So yeah, I think that's a really good idea about these, you know, that they can then remove them if they needed to and you can then at least, you know, barricade this bit up. Um would be quite nice. Makes sense, doesn't it? Then they've got to hold this bit here, you know, so if somebody was fighting up, it makes totally sense, doesn't it? Be cool. Whoa, thank you so much, Optic Predator XGN XGN. Thank you so much for the two bucks, man. It's really nice of you. Hopefully the message will come up in a second and uh, be really loud, like it normally is. <laughs> At least it's really loud for me. But it's not going... Oh, yeah. I think there actually is a limit, isn't there? I think I did put a limit on it. Um, so, basically what... Never mind. <laughs> Didn't put a limit. Yo, what up, my dude? By the way, never seen you. Yeah, thank you so much, Optic Predator. If you do have Discord, please do feel free to join our Discord and I will add you into our group that we have. So we do have a, a Discord group for donators. Could I build like a German sub? There's a couple of them on the internet actually if you look for any type of U-boats. There are quite a few U-boats. If that's, I'm guessing that's what you're talking about. Because uh, it's usually U-boat related um, whenever people say German sub. But yeah, there is a couple um, around if you do want it. Um, already on, on the YouTubes. You'd be surprised how many people have built stuff. Uh, the other thing is have a look on Planet Minecraft. Um, they've got some pretty good, but to be fair, there's some amazing stuff in Planet Minecraft. It really is. But yeah. Dang. Uh, so, Mimikau, getting up those stairs, Defender will, will be exposed to any fire. Um, maybe there should be a second stair, stairway behind the tower. Oh, you mean like here? Yeah. Um, I don't know. Because... To me, the you know, if if you if you're under prop, well, to be fair, if you're under proper siege, you're, you're pretty much screwed anyway. Um, at least this one, you're all right because it's, you know it's out of the way, and this one's all right as well. It's you know it's a bit e, isn't it? But I don't know. We'll see. It's not like that. Potentially. <laughs> so Malcolm Brown. Oh God, there's text to speech. I know. I switched it on like. Um, before I uh, before I you know stopped for a bit before I had a break, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I think it's great, and also obviously the tune as well. But it is quite loud. <laughs> that's the only thing. Um, but it's quite good in case I don't have the uh, thing up and I don't see it. Then uh, then it actually just you know instead completely deafens me, which I quite like. You know, it's quite good. I think that's what you need, right? Cool. You and any uh, Aaron Lowe has got to go. No worries, man. Thank you very much for coming on, as you always do. It's really nice of you. Um, type typical. Please, can I have some comments on what this castle is? Um, I mean, I literally started building it yesterday. There's the context really is that I was trying to build. I was going to build something on Hamburg, and I didn't. Uh, and I came over here, and I built. I built this instead. I started building this. Uh, I spent an hour and a half just just laying down blocks, really. Um, just getting like a rough shape together. I wanted it to be really quite square and pointy with these kind of like crazy roofs. So I went with this kind of like crazy pointy roof, which I really like. So yeah. So I kind of like went with that instead. So I mean that was that was pretty good. But that, that's literally it. There's um there's not too much else really. I know that sounds a bit weird. Um, but it protects this this river. So here's Hamburg. 
So the river going up here, it's going to be part of a different kingdom than Henberg. And I, I know on the map, I think we even laid out some other stuff. But I think there's caves in this in this area here. So could actually have the the road going over there to go to dwarves or something. That'd be that'd be quite interesting. But I don't know we'll, we'll see how it kind of like goes really. Ah, smoke about. Thankfully there aren't any trolls around here. You never know. Damn optic! Thank you so much, dude. That is so nice of you, honestly. But there you go. I can see you now on uh, on Discord because you posted. Thank you very much. And you are in the donator role. I'm just waiting until. Uh, well, there we go. I just had the mega mega lag. Um, I'm just waiting until it goes. D -d 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 -d, you know the music type thing. <laughs> Obviously not. Dun -dun 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 -dun. But yeah. Oh yeah. Here we go. That's it. That's what I wanted. Have some money, my dude. Thank you so much, man. It's really nice of you. So I came in. I came into work so early this morning. <laughs> Ugh, annoying. But you know, that's, that's kind of like the way it is, isn't it? Some days you end up having to work for ages, and sometimes you don't. No, actually, you don't. Actually, I always work really long. <laughs> not really, really long hours. It's not that bad, actually. Not at all pretty good but yeah optic thank you so much man that's so nice of you uh but is there a way to donate via paypal there is yeah do you have to use mastercard on on um on super chat i've never used super chat i've only ever done it like if i'm if i'm you know watching sips or something like that i'll do it via um it'll be well via paypal via the link but i don't know i don't know how it works i need to have a look at it i'll definitely have a look at it man but yeah there is definitely a troll cave around here. Alright, man. Tyler, we will build a troll cave somewhere around here. Alright, tell you what. That'll be enough for that little bit of the um, fly around the... What's it called? The time lapse bit. So, I mean, it's, it's laid out a little bit of the kind of like detail. We need to sort out this side and the gatehouse bits. Uh, and we need to put, obviously, more of the shooty holes in. <laughs> um, that will add in a, a ton of, like, you know, detail to the whole thing. So, we can look at doing that without a doubt. Right, so let's close that, and then we'll have a quick look, and I'll show you guys what um, we did on Vestia because it's been it's been ages since we've done that, you know. Let's get some shaders on, and I'll go make some food because I'm hungry. <laughs> that castle would fit into well into an ice biome, um, perhaps inhabited by snow elves. Oh man, my snow elves are going to be. I've got a weird style for my snow elves. They're going to be really like more like vampires they're going to be like blood orientated their whole religion is oriented around blood and sacrifice so they but they're, they're going to be like the most pale kind of like or, um elves you've ever seen but they're just going to be dark red eyes kind of like elves so really evil and i've kind of got this weird thinking behind it all but i don't know we'll see we'll kind of like see how it is you know yeah okay Right, there we go. That looks a lot better. Looks a lot better with shaders, doesn't it? it? Always does. The only thing is with shaders, we'll obviously die with the whole thing. There we go. So yeah, I think we'll, we can continue on that as, at some point, and obviously sort out the bridge, lower it, having gone down. Actually, if we go through, I think there's caves, but I don't know what they're like. Yeah, there is caves. Oh yeah, these are the weird pink caves. Yeah, I remember that now. So that they're weird pink caves. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe we won't have dwarves in here. That would be very strange. But we could have elves or something, couldn't we? We could have some strange elves. Make it like really lit up and have because um, elves did inher in, in actually uh, inhabit these lands. So we could have something like that. You know, it goes goes up a uh, goes from that bridge and moves us all the way up. I don't know. Damn Optic, thank you so much for the five dollars again. Bro, it's two twenty AM here for me here in Australia, disappointed face. Damn, that's too that's late, you know. That's quite late. Um, right. So if we zoom I'm gonna zoom this way. I know we can use the, the waypoints and everything, but I quite like zooming across the land. It's just kinda like you get to see how much more we've got to do. <laughs> really? So tired. This video will be up on um YouTube as well. So the good thing about 
well, the main reason I stream on YouTube is because it allows you to um, it automatically uploads the video. It's great, totally great. You should make a crystal cave in the cave. Do you mean castle? Castle cave in the cave? Where are we now, anyway? I think we're on Aelon. Across the ri ro uh, river type thing. Okay. Across that. I know somebody... Who's building on this at the minute? Somebody's building on that. I've seen t pictures of Twitter on it. And I think... Is Vigorman building on the claw? Have I seen that yet? I haven't seen the proper thing, but... I think he is building on the claw. Which is this whole area <laughs> which looks like a claw. Yeah. Pixies. <laughs> we could go with those evil pixies, couldn't we? Living in that cave, that'd be weird, wouldn't it? Ugh. Dang, my map renders quickly. Uh, 64 gigs of RAM does help. Um, <laughs> really does help. I have not. Where are we? Right, I've. M no, I haven't missed it. Yeah, I have. I've got to go north. There we go. Right. North. I think it's that way. Yeah, it is. Go that way. We'll find it. But yeah, we can do some caves around this area. I want to fill it out as well. Um, kind of before I actually put up the, the Hemburg thing. After we finish off Hemburg. Oop. Of course you can. That's absolutely fine. Give me a sec. There you go. I've sent you one optic, so you should have got that. There you go. But yeah, thank you, you so can much I again. Add you as a friend on Discord, Lord D A K R. <laughs> I love that, Lord D A K R. Amazing. Thank you so much, buddy. Right, so. If we go around to... We still need to finish this, by the way. We still need to finish the Silver Sage. I mean, this has still got to be finished. You know, we're not... We're not actually that far off of it, either. So, I do love the inn. I've got to... I've, I'm going to convert that to um, default and tutorial, that one, for sure. Uh, the Drunken Dog, because we did do that on the stream. But we need to finish a couple more of the areas around here. Uh, and build Lord Sa Silver Sage's place. But, um... The main thing I was getting on around this area is what I want to do with, well, all of the areas, which is, you know, like, build stuff like mines like this, where we've got a pretty cool mine that goes down. Um, which I really like. I really like the mines. You know, have some proper things, like, in here. But I do want to put some people around as well, you know, so get the custom NPCs. And I don't know if you can do, get them to do, like, actions, uh, actions or anything like that. That'd be really good. But yeah. I'm kind of like C, I guess. Um, but yeah, we got that, and the other stuff like Helven's Hollow. Don't know if you guys remember Helven's Hollow, but you know, this is Helven's Hollow, the whole cave thing. So I want to do more of this stuff, even though it takes ages. But it, it looks really nice. So there's that too. I think there's a way of is there a light that comes in from somewhere? Yeah, I thought I did that. This little bit here, which I really like. I really like doing stuff like that, and then obviously this leads to. Camp of what's it called? Those people, weird flag thing, signal towers, and then go to forts down here. And everybody hates this fort because you can't. Technically, I've made, I've even made a path behind it, so yeah, you could totally invade it. But whatever, it's an old fort, a very old fort. But you know, I want to I want to do more of this stuff. The only thing is, I need to go around and just update all these textures because this looks this looks horrible. <laughs> I've put too many burnt blocks on this. I'm now looking at this again. So I need to go through and like update stuff. But this is where it all started was Wagon Dale. Um, so that kind of like started off the whole thing. And then, yeah, we went on to Old Off Grove. This whole grove thing here, which we need to finish. Yeah. Damn optic, another five dollars. What? What is with you? By man? the way, hit that little bell, like the villain sub. Thanks, dude. Thank you so much. Um. But yeah, we do need to continue with Vestiria at the minute, I'm uh, as well, at some point. So I want to continue on to Highgard and like complete this area, but another signal tower here. And I did start doing a path through these crazy hills, so we actually have got uh, like a, a path going through here, which goes down. And I did see this bit. This bit's really cool. Um, 
So I was thinking, like, do we actually put in something to get into these caves? But these are really dark caves. But there is some, you know, they've got lots of trees in here as well. So it's like more of a grove, you know, like the Skyrim ones. You know. But yeah. I know, but yeah, I'm that's what I want to do around that area anyway. That's what I'm planning. Um, but yeah, guys, I think that's going to be it. I'm going to make some make some food. Um, just chill out for a little bit. Um, but let me know what you guys want next. If you want me to continue building, um, you know, Queen Anne's Revenge or a bit more Hamburg. So uh, we do need to finish up Hamburg. And, you know, we'll kind of like see where we go from there, really. I mean... Would be nice to finish off Hamburg, really, or, or at least the next episode of it, so we can get that that time lapse done. Uh, would definitely be quite good, I think. But uh, I don't know. We'll see. Depends. Or Queen Anne's, Queen Anne's Revenge. It's like one of those. It's really difficult. Or the castle that we've just been building for the last, you know, hour and a bit. But yeah. Um, anyway, thank you guys. Thank you very much for watching. I will see you on the next one.